changing perspectives, winning hearts. Sports is the catalyst for change. The Paralympic logo, also known as Ajitos, symbolizes this court with a set of three elements in motion around a central point. The purpose of the Ajitos, which is translated to I move in Latin, is to constantly evolve, inspire, change and transform alongside achieving sporting excellence. The Paralympics 2024 recently concluded in September and India has shown brighter than ever with a record number of 29 medals. Through this article, let's journey along with the athletes to understand how they got here and where their dreams are taking them in the future. Sports for persons with disabilities has been in existence for over a hundred years, but formal competition on a global platform began in 1960 with the first Paralympic Games. Back then, the purpose was to boost morale for injured war veterans and civilians just emerging from World War II. What started initially to support rehabilitation for these athletes soon evolved into a competitive area where the athletes trained to compete for the ultimate sporting glory, the Paralympic medals. To encapsulate the evolution of the Paralympics in a nutshell, the Paralympics have grown from 400 athletes participating in the first game ever to over 4,400 athletes in the recently concluded Paris Paralympics 2024. Over these 80 years, sports has transformed to become inclusive and disability has been normalized in the context of competition. Alongside breaking some phenomenal records on land and in water, athletes are breaking barriers between ability and disability. The Paralympic Games, a brief overview. Paris played host to the 2024 Paralympic Games with 22 sports and 549 medals to be won. Set against the iconic landmarks of Parisian monuments like the Eiffel Tower, Versailles and Grand Palais, the Paralympics lasted about 10 days filled with triumph, tears of joy and absolute resilience. 40 world records were broken this summer. Some included all-time records, inclusive of both Olympic and Paralympic feats. From games such as boccia, one of the only sports that does not have an Olympic counterpart, to para canoe and blind football, every game opened new doors for athletes to challenge themselves and strive for glory. Glory for themselves, their loved ones and their countries. With the rise in social media coverage and better access to technology, every game has been beautifully explained for laypersons to understand and feel like they are a live spectator. I highly recommend visiting the Paralympics website to understand how different games work, their modifications to suit various disabilities, and how they may be different or similar to their Olympic counterparts. The website is www.paralympic.org slash Paris hyphen 2024. Paralympics, qualifications and modifications. To qualify, participants have to demonstrate eligibility based on their disabilities. Qualified participants are then categorized based on their levels of functioning in order to create a more equitable playing field amongst the competing athletes. Sports are modified with accommodations based on levels of functioning. So, for example, some sports include an assistant to support the athlete by navigating the wheelchairs. No sport feels out of bounds. Athletes take on rapids in para canoe, shoot arrows and pistols using their shoulder strength with minimal limb support, and play basketball on wheelchairs. Those who have limited mobility on land can swim with the agility of fish in the pool. Similar to the Olympic Games this year, every medal contains a small piece of the Eiffel Tower, but with tactile markings, including Braille, to distinguish them. Paralympics, the spirit of sport. While there are participants who were born with disabilities, there are also those that acquired them through traumatic events such as accidents, war and degenerative conditions. The Paralympics play host to participants at any stage in their life. Through their expression of sport, each participant carries a narrative of their own journey. 
Dreams may have shifted, goals may have changed, but the persistence to strive for excellence has not wavered. Let's meet some of this year's champions and understand the spirit of sport from their perspectives. Avni Lekhara, India's proud champion and gold medalist in shooting, speaks of how sports helped her come out of her own shell after an accident in 2012 left her with paraplegia. Avni is also one of the only athletes from India to defend her own gold medal from the Tokyo 2021 Olympics. She talks of determination in only focusing on her target when she competes, ensuring that she aims right by blocking out all the noise. She talks about the team that backs her relentlessly and her own unwavering spirit in defending her gold medal. Claiming the first medal for the international refugee team, a bronze in para-taekwondo, Zakia Khudadadi from Afghanistan won battles long before she competed in sporting events. Born with an atrophied arm in a war-torn country, Zakia's determination in rebuilding her life is nothing short of wonder. Goals can grow on you, and Zakia embodies this, as she claims that she never really liked para-taekwondo when she first started. But her determination to hone her craft helped cultivate the passion in the sport, culminating in the ultimate triumph of a Paralympic medal. She now calls the sport a ray of sunshine. A highlight of this year's competition has been Sheetal Devi, whose tenacity in archery far exceeds her actual age of 17 years. Born in a small village in Jammu and Kashmir, with a rare condition that limits the growth of her limbs, Sheetal's early childhood included building her upper body strength through adventures like climbing trees. Although she experimented with the use of prosthetics to support her goal in para-archery, she learned quickly that this wasn't her cup of tea. Adapting her skills to match her determination and ability, Sheetal triumphed with a bronze medal this year at the Paralympics. Goals are not always individual in nature. Sometimes a family aligns their goals to match the athletes, and that propels the athlete forward with a singular focus to win. Pranav Surma's journey is a reflection of this, as he celebrates his silver medal in men's club throw. Behind Pranav, both literally and figuratively, stands his father, Sanjeev. Sanjeev helps Pranav navigate his wheelchair at the arena. The father-son duo are, are also easily identified with their matching hairstyles and beard, a dashing pair. Pranav's dreams changed course when a heavy cement load fell on him at the age of 16 years, causing significant spinal cord damage and quadriplegia. To emphasize on the previous sentence, the dreams didn't end, they changed course. Pranav not only trained to become a para-athlete, but also worked on his academics alongside, qualifying to work at a bank after a degree from the Delhi School of Economics. His parents' dreams changed course too, with his mother deciding to become the primary income earner and his proud father backing Pranav's goal in every conceivable way. Today, his triumph is his parents' triumph. His parents' pride is the nation's pride. Paralympics Winning Hearts Just like life, the Paralympics has also given spectators some truly heartwarming moments. Who can forget the iconic celebrations of the Paralympic athlete Hunter Woodall, who won gold in men's 400 meters race, and Olympic athlete Tara Davis Woodall, who won gold in women's long jump. This husband-wife duo won hearts globally in their sheer excitement of cheering one another from the stands and celebrating their twin wins. The Paralympics also saw four proposals take place after athletes realized both their professional and personal dreams of asking their partners to marry them, after their competitions ended. After all, Paris is the city of love. Paralympics, the journey ahead. The tone of this article has largely been positive, and it is not only meant to invigorate and inspire readers into understanding the transformative power of sport, but also open the forum to discuss what's next. The official Instagram page of the Paralympics put out an incredibly powerful message about sports being one of the easier places for para-athletes to showcase their best selves. 
navigating daily lives in a world that is largely inaccessible is much harder and arduous. Stairs, they say, are some of the hardest challenges they need to overcome daily. These athletes that win medals on a global arena are contending with what most people wouldn't even consider to be a nemesis. The Paris Paralympics brought with it some nuggets of change, overground transportation was made more accessible for spectators, and athletes could navigate sporting venues more easily. It also brought visibility, with more media channels airing the Paralympic Games on mainstream platforms to increase the viewership. With India's record-breaking performance, more people are now attuned to understanding the grit, determination and focus that it takes to train as an athlete. The hope is that it sparks more ideas in people to make the world accessible, so people with disabilities rightly place navigating the Paralympics as more challenging than navigating their own office buildings. To conclude, let's go back to the beginning and think about the Paralympics logo, three elements that are constantly in motion, to transform, to evolve, and to break barriers that come between ability and disability. These athletes have already won our hearts, it's now time for us to change our perspectives. Information, quotes, and stories for this article has been sourced from the Paralympic website.